So that's basically my reason for buying the full tone Octafuzz pedal. I remember seeing either a picture or video of Gary Clark Jr's rig and straight away hopping on a tram to town to try out and buy the pedal. It was the first fuzz pedal that I really connected with. Long before that I had a big muff which I really didn't get along with. Then I had a weird Ibanez Tone Lock series fuzz which sounded like garbage when playing hard like I did back then. Both those pedals are great for other players, I've, I've definitely heard a lot of good big muff sounds, but yeah, it just wasn't for me at the time. Now the Octofuzz was something completely different. In the normal fuzz mode it was fat, juicy and creamy, but not too muddy. In the Octave mode it was crazy, spitty and buzzy in a great way. It's still one of my best purchases. I've gigged and recorded a bunch with it, and even though it doesn't feature a lot of controls, I can always get something different from it. Play it with other amps, pedals or guitars and it will react in a different way. Let's try some different settings, amps and guitars and see how it can sound. <laughs>
Thank you so much for watching. Have you ever tried an octopus pedal? If so, what do you think of it? Please comment down below, like and subscribe for more gear related content and I'll see you next time. Yeah.